I'm 37 years old and I started losing my hair when I was 17. <laughs> and this is not a topic that is easy for me to talk about, but I'm going to share with you today how I not only stopped my hair loss, but reversed it and grew back my hair. And I'm going to show you my before and afters. I did all of this naturally without any surgery, without any medical intervention. And I do believe that this video today is going to help a lot of people who might be experiencing hair loss. Hi guys, my name is Ashley Salvatore. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button and be sure to check out my Instagram where I am active every single day with motivation, inspiration, and just to help you live your best life. Today's topic is one that I struggled with for years to share this because it's one of those things that is really hard for a female, for a woman to start losing their hair. Now, a little bit of a background, my grandmother lost most of her hair. She wore like a cap thing for like 40 years. <laughs> Genetically, um, my hair started falling out and getting very thin from the time I was about 17 is really when I started noticing it. My mom told me that my grandmother felt really bad that she basically gave me this gene. <laughs> and, you know, whatever the reason for this, you know, it's not diet related for me in my case. It, it may be for you. If it is for you diet related, then you may want to try some other things. You need to kind of work on that specific scenario or situation. If you have sudden hair loss, that might be a little bit different, but I do actually think that these methods that I'm going to talk about today that helped me grow my hair back would really help anyone with any sort of hair loss scenario, but I do recommend that you talk to your doctor and, and consult a physician before you do anything regarding your health or hair or anything like that. Okay, so let's get into this. I started losing my hair very young age and it continually progressively got worse and worse and then I had kids and then it got worse and worse and worse. And I'll show you my before photo right here of at my worst. And that was just a couple years ago. I decided to take it into my own hands. I, I didn't wanna lose it all, you know what I mean? I didn't wanna lose all of my hair. So I did some research, I started doing some research and I came across some things. And the very first thing that I decided to try was red light therapy. You may have heard of red light therapy. It's very, very popular. It's all over the place. I actually even just got like a sauna blanket for red light therapy to help with like cellulite and um, to help induce a sweat and sort of that sort of thing. Infrared sauna. I have one of those, but separately for hair, um, my first introduction to red light therapy was with this cap. Just to let you guys know, I don't sponsor any of the brands that I'm talking about today. I don't even earn a commission from anything. If you purchase any of these products, it doesn't impact me in any way. This is literally just the strategy that I was using and everything that I'm saying is just completely my own experience, opinion, and that sort of thing. I do love these products. They've changed my life. They've changed the game for my hair, which leads to more confidence, which has led to success in my business too, because without that, I lacked confidence to be able to put myself on camera, to be able to put myself forward, to be doing things like this, creating videos, which has built and grown my business. So there's a huge ripple that this whole thing has basically led to within my life. Getting back to the topic, very first thing that I decided to try, it was a huge investment. I had to take a huge leap of faith that this would work without knowing that it would actually work. I just had to believe that it would. So I invested in this cap. Now what this cap is, it has all of these lasers. I got the most expensive one that has the most lasers. I believe it's about 275 red light lasers, okay? What I really liked about this cap was that you only have to wear it for six minutes a day. And so with my routine, what I did was I would take a shower every morning and then I would blow dry my hair and then I would put this cap on and it's got the little button, you push the button, the red lights turn on and it goes for six minutes and while this thing is going, I do my makeup, okay? So this has been my my in my routine and I really haven't talked about it on this channel or in my vlogs or in my what I eat in a day things because I wasn't sure if this was gonna work. And so I've kind of kept this part of it kind of 
secret um also it's embarrassing like it just is like hair loss for whatever reason is embarrassing it's like an embarrassing topic it's really actually hard for me to actually create this video i just know by me sharing what's working for me and what's helped me it's gonna help a lot a lot of people i just know it and so i'm gonna put that aside and i'm gonna share it with you guys um with hopes that whatever i share with you today is gonna impact your life so um six minutes a day and uh, off the top of my head, I don't know how long I've used this so far, but I know it's been years. So it's been a couple years. I will put the exact date right here <laughs> when I can go back and I can actually look up when I started this, how long it's been, okay, since I've started using this cap. I've been religious with it. I have not missed, maybe I missed a day here or there, but every day I do it and it's, it's no problem. It's not painful. It doesn't, there's no issues. The biggest thing is time and also money okay so like i said it's expensive this is how much mine cost They're, they do have other options that have less lights i but i don't have experience with those i know there are other products as well there are like light brushes you can use i don't know how well those work i wanted something this was almost like my last ditch effort to try to reverse this myself before i looked into things like hair transplant surgery and different things like that because i was desperate like i just don't want to lose all my hair i just don't i was really impressed with the results that i got from this now i added on top of this an extra layer okay so with the routine of this they do sell like different lotions and stuff that you can put on your hair and I've tried them but the problem is you put it on your scalp and it makes your hair gunky, uh, d different texture. You know what I'm talking about when you put product in your hair and it's just, it's not the same, especially hair loss products i've tried them all over the years you know well i can't really say that because i haven't tried them all but you know we know what i'm talking about like the rogaine for women all of those things and they definitely make your hair doesn't it doesn't style well i found on the internet this which i was really excited about and i'm bringing it to you guys today because it works because I, I think it was about one year into the cap that I decided to add on these shampoos and this lotion and so if you can't afford the cap I strongly recommend you go out and you get at least this system okay it's gonna blow your mind you guys the results that you get when you do this consistently but I do believe the cap is accelerating it for me the results that I'm getting with this so here's how it comes first we'll talk about this like solution all right so it comes like this and the little guy is kind of sliding around here I have this delivered monthly okay and it's called Vegamore grow if you can see that there okay they have a couple different kinds i started with the lower efficiency one it's pink this one has um additional properties in here there is cbd in this one and this one is supposed to get the best results and so i for the majority of the time i've been using this one so like i've been doing this over a year and again i will give you exact time right here once i go back and i look at my receipts from when i bought it and when i actually started using it apply once daily for three to four months for visible results continue use to maintain i use this every single day and there's no residue it's not it, you don't even notice it on your head um i do fill up like three droppers full and i just like squirt it all over my scalp i rub it in and i get it in there really really good and then i blow dry my hair and then i put the cap on and so this stuff i i really strongly recommend and the thing is when i first got it i would i used it and then like i was very infrequent with it and i was like i have to be consistent with this routine if i want to see results i got to be consistent with it you can't just use something every once in a while you got to do it every single day so i tried to get it into like my routine every single day after my shower, put it on right before I blow dry my hair, and then I put my cap on. So this is made with ingredients clinically shown in some subject to reduce shedding by up to 76% and increase the appearance of the hair density up to 51%. Uh, I will tell you guys, 
It's amazing. Cruelty-free, it's 100% vegan, it's gluten-free, paraben-free, hormone-free, toxin-free, dye-free, synthetic fragrance-free, um, a bunch of other things that I can't even pronounce, free, castor oil free, and petroleum free. And so this was really good. Okay guys, so I would suggest you guys get this. This made a huge difference in, in my hair growth and I think that it really um, supercharged things for me. Now, in addition to that, once I started seeing results from that, I was like, you know what, I need to do, I need to get more. Like, I wanna get more results. <laughs> so, I added on their shampoo. It's very expensive. Like, I'm talking, um, I believe for the two of these, like $70 or so for the shampoo. I'll put the price right here. <laughs> what I actually paid but off the top of my head I think that's what it is right around there but it's worth it it's so worth it I'm very very sensitive with my hair because it's so thin I have to use specific types of shampoos or else I have issues and these the shampoo and the conditioner I can do it the conditioner all the way up to my root and then I, it washes out clean and I have no issues at all it doesn't weigh my hair down I really really love it fortified with broad spectrum CBD to bring you visibly Thicker, fuller, healthier hair made with vegan bee silk protein, smooths, deeply hydrates, repairs damaged hair cuticles. So they also have it in the formula that does not have CBD. That's another option. I started with that, moved on to this. So I kind of like graduated into the more expensive program when I realized that this actually works. And so I have this coming every single month. I have this coming every single month. And this has been like my strategy. And these, these two things are like my one-two punch like I do these things every single day and I believe my results came from that so you can check out my before and afters okay so this was my before this is what it was like I got guys I gotta tell you it was extremely painful like just in life in general just feeling like I'm very young but it's like aging me rapidly just losing my hair like this the other thing that's really cool about the cap is it actually gets rid of gray hair and it works like I, on the top of my head, I don't have gray hair, but like underneath, I will, I have gray hair. Like, I don't know if you, the camera can even see this, but I do. <laughs> and um, so that's helped me. So like, I don't have to dye my hair and like different things like that, that you wouldn't even think about, but it is really cool. This red light therapy, it helps with gray hair. And if you have gray hair, you will notice the strand will be gray and then your root will start being brown or whatever color your hair is. So I think that's a cool um, feature of that cap. That's definitely worth it. So let's talk about what I did while I'm focusing on growing my hair back and how I concealed my thinning hair. Okay. So over the years, you've seen me on this channel. Um, if you've been watching for a while, you've seen the different stages of my hair thinning. So at first I was using this hair building fibers um basically all over my head and then and it would get really really thick in like the hairline and then it's just not natural to just be completely filled in at the hairline and so like you would see that in my old videos because i didn't really know what i was doing i was just trying to like hide my scalp so then i figured something out that's really cool and i found this stuff this gray away root touch up magnetic powder from ever pro and I decided to give this a try, okay? And this stuff works so well on the hairline and you can kind of still see your, like you can build it, right? So it's like buildable coverage. Then give it like makeup for your hair. And so what I do is I will just like fill in, it comes with this little, this little pad and the powder and I just dip it in here and then I first will fill in my hairline and fill that in and some, and what I'll do is I'll pull up my hair a little bit and I will just fill it in. And I do use this only on like my hairline area and then I use this still to this day to fill in all the other areas. So I'll kind of like lift up my hair in like these larger areas and I'll like dump it on. And especially in like the back, the back of my hair, it's really easy to just kind of like dump this around and have it you know fill in like the back of my head and some people you know might be seeing and experiencing hair loss like on the crown area and so that's really good to like fill that in the colors i use is medium brown okay medium brown works really really well for me and i have, even have pretty dark hair 
the dark brown or the black is way too dark for me and it's noticeable and the other thing is when you doing this I really had to stop like highlighting my hair and if I got highlights and the highlights went too close to the root this would no longer work and so and I, I really need to like still I still need to use this like I feel I don't have to use it as often but I feel better when I use it you know if that makes sense and so that's one of the reasons why I really don't highlight my hair and if I do I would do like the balayage where it's like lighter here but it's like darker at the root these two things you can get on Amazon I'll put the link in the description below if you want to check these out they come in a bunch of different colors the color I have on this one uh oh it's kind of faded I believe it's dark brown but I will put the exact color in the description below so that you know which one that I use if you have similar dark brown hair to me so that's kind of how I conceal it how I conceal the balding and that's helped me actually put myself out there with my business on social media all of these things and it's built my confidence it's this is like one of those examples where like I knew there was a solution I knew the solution was out there and I kind of knew that the solution would come to me and it did come to me and I was like open to try it and I was like I'll give this a try and I'll see what happens and like a couple years down the line um, and it just keeps getting better too like my results keep improving keep getting better I've completely stopped the hair loss and I've reversed it and now I am building and growing new follicles in its place and so that's extremely exciting and I don't know how much of that really is the cap and how much of that is this product you know again it depends on budget if you're like I don't think I have budget for the cap you know if you have to get the lower lying cap that's better than nothing even though it covers less area that's better than just not doing the cap at all so like if I could only afford that one I would totally do it I would say go for it um, but if you can go with the cap that has the most lights I would say that would be ideal and for sure if you're only have it in your budget to do one thing I would say do this one thing okay do this one thing this serum this hair grow hair serum if you have it in your budget to do the hair serum plus the shampoos that would be ideal beyond that for sure covering it up with these methods now I'm curious if you've experienced hair loss in your life or thinning hair um, what do you do to conceal it let me know below are you getting hair extensions are you doing you know wigs do you use these products have you tried these products I've also there's another one that is like this that's a little bit less expensive that is also very good the downside with this is I would say <laughs> if you're like sleeping on a white pillow sometimes you know these fibers they will kind of like rub off on your pillow at first it kind of annoyed me now I don't really care I mean I wash my pillows all the time um, it doesn't really rub off on other things like like the couch as much or like the car at least for me I don't really notice it and it doesn't stain okay so that's the biggest thing it does not stain it's fibers they're little fibers you just wipe them off or in the case of the pillow sheets you wash them off they come off it comes off when you wash your hair it comes off completely and then you just have to do it. it's just gonna be a part of your routine every single day to just kind of hide the areas that might be thinning a little bit while you are working on growing and building back your hair so hopefully this video helped you share it with someone this is a totally free video not sponsored by anyone except for Amazon these are connected to my Amazon affiliate links so I do earn a commission when you click that link and you purchase something from Amazon thank you it's a very very tiny little commission but whatever I'm not here and I'm not doing this to make money I'm here and doing this to have an impact share my experience my journey and help someone because I was in that place where you might be right now where like you don't know what to do you don't know if these things work and you don't know where to go and also how to like conceal it so you can move on with your life um, these are all things that like I wish I knew five years earlier or ten years earlier right we have all this amazing technology around us we should take advantage of it so anyway guys if you're new here be sure you hit that subscribe button if there's something that you want to see a type of video that you want to see from me put it in the comments below and I will work on that for you and let's connect the Instagram go to my Instagram page and follow along in my daily stories and everything in the content that I have there to help you live your best healthiest life